In 1879, Constantin Falberg, a chemist working at Johns Hopkins University, made an accidental discovery that would change the world of sweeteners forever. After a long day in the lab, Falberg noticed an unusually sweet taste on his bread during dinner, despite not having added any sugar. Intrigued, he traced the sweetness back to a chemical compound he had been working with earlier that day, benzoic sulfamidae. This compound, later named saccharin, was found to be 300 times sweeter than sugar, yet contained no calories. Falberg's discovery led to the commercial production of saccharin, which gained popularity during sugar shortages in World Wars I and II. As concerns about sugar consumption and obesity grew, artificial sweeteners became increasingly popular in diet foods and beverages. Saccharin's success spurred the development of other artificial sweeteners like aspartame, sucralose, and stevia each with unique properties. Today, artificial sweeteners are a multi-billion dollar industry offering consumers a wide range of low calorie options. However, ongoing research continues to explore the long-term health effects of artificial sweeteners, balancing their benefits with potential risks. As we look to the future, the quest for the perfect sugar substitute continues, driven by the same spirit of innovation that led to Falberg's accidental discovery over a century ago.